Bleu de Chanel Eau de Toilette versus Bleu de Chanel Eau de Parfum. 2024 marks 10 years since this fragrance was released. Are you still wearing one? Let me know in the comments. So I get asked this question a lot. Which is the best? Which one should you buy? So let's get into this. They obviously both share the same scent DNA. The only difference is the EDT opens up with a slightly stronger, more crisp citrus note, while the EDP is smoother. But on the dry down, I really can't tell the difference. They do have some different notes, as you can see. But overall, they're both clean, classy, and masculine fragrances, with grapefruit, citrus, and aromatic woods. They're definitely one of the best quality blue fragrances. I don't get any noticeable difference in the longevity. I get a good 9 to 10 hours on skin, and it lasts for days if sprayed on your jacket. They both have moderate projection, but you do get a nice scent trail. It's subtle, but still gets noticed. You haven't got to worry about offending anyone's nostrils while wearing this. Bruh. It's perfect for daily use, office environments, school, gym, or any time, really. It's definitely one of the safest fragrances you can wear. I don't think you can go wrong with owning either of them. Everyone always talks about the EDP, but I think I actually prefer the EDT. I think the name gets too much hate like Dior Sauvage just because it's popular, but they're popular for good reason. 